This is Helvetia, the symbol of Switzerland. She is going to tell us how the Federal Council works. We live in a fascinating world of communication and we all play our own part in that world. We chat, post, tweet and share photos. As ordinary members of the public, we are more or less free as to how we communicate. Of course, it is rather different for the Federal Council. It has to follow certain rules. It has to tell the public about its policies. The Federal Constitution and countless other laws require it to do so. The Federal Council must actively and objectively inform the public about its decisions. It must explain why it has decided to do something or not do something. It cannot withhold information. It must take responsibility when things don't go to plan. As citizens, we have to know where our government stands. This is especially important in a direct democracy. Three to four times a year, we vote on government or parliamentary business. We can only form an opinion on these proposals if we understand what they are all about. Whenever the Federal Council holds a meeting, communication staff are hard at work. That's hardly surprising. The Federal Council sometimes decides on more than 100 items of business in one sitting. Press releases are issued, even while the meeting is still in progress. On top of that, there are online dossiers, background information and infographics to prepare. For the most important issues, the members of the Federal Council hold a press conference. The Federal Council spokesperson and the Federal Chancellery manage the government's communications, along with the seven government departments. And of course, these days, the Federal Council communicates through social media too. This also happens in the run-up to a popular vote. The Federal Council provides official information on popular votes on its Vote Info app. This includes the texts from the red pamphlet explaining the issues, along with explanatory videos. Hmm, I've just found some photos of two Federal Councillors on Instagram. They're actually not bad at all. But of course, I can do much better than that. <laughs>